Ask and it shall be given unto you. Seek and ye shall find. Knock and it shall be opened unto you. Matthew 7 and verse 7. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how I installed this gorgeous 18 inch honey blonde unit that I got from Sealy Hair Company. So they sent me over their 13 by 4 180% density honey blonde unit and this is in 18 inches. I'll leave all the information as well as a discount code in my description bar down below if you are interested in purchasing this unit. And so far I'm definitely loving this unit. This unit is definitely a vibe. The curls, the highlights, the honey blonde color, it's everything you guys so if you are interested to see how i installed this honey blonde unit well keep on watching don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't as yet give this video a big thumbs up and to comment down in the comment section board down below so let's jump right into the installation process of this 18 inch honey blonde unit from Sealy hair company so the unit that i'm going to be installing and reviewing today is in collaboration with Sealy hair company they were gracious enough to send me over their 18 inch 180 percent density honey blonde unit so a bit about this unit this is a 13 by 4 lace frontal wig it did come pre-plucked so a bit about the inside cap construction on this unit it has three combs behind of the lace one to the back and it also came with adjustable straps as well so you can adjust this unit to your particular liking so along with this 18 inch unit from Sealy hair company they sent me over a pouch with goodies i received a pair of eyelashes a hair bonnet i also received an edge brush a rat tail comb, a pair of stocking a cap, headband, and their hair care instruction as well, along with two clamp clips. So let's jump right into the installation process. So the video today is also in collaboration with BC Way on Amazon. This is their 1.5 wide plated pink designed hair straightener. So a bit about this flat iron, it has a PTC heating technology which ensures constant and stable heat. It also has a LCD digital display along with a safety lock function and this flat iron goes from 250 degrees up to 450 degrees Fahrenheit. Today the wig that I'm going to be installing and reviewing is from C. So the wig hair came company. in this box of right here along with some other goodies as well. This is their 18 inch honey blonde highlighted unit. So I did went ahead to pre-pluck the hair. I also bleached the knots on this unit and I did went ahead to curl the hair prior. So this is the wig right here. I did went ahead to pre-curl the hair using my flexi rod instead of doing pin curls because to me when I use flexi rods they actually last longer than if I do the pin curl. So to do this install today you guys I'm also going to be using some ORS products. So these are the new ORS olive oil products. This is the Fix It Super Hold Spray. I guess you guys heard of this spray a lot. So this is so I'm going to be testing out this spray to see if it actually is better than got to be blast free spray because you guys know I live in the Caribbean and we only have two seasons wet and dry season where it's raining a lot or either it's hot. And I'm also going to be using their ORS olive oil hold and shine wrap and set in mousse. So this so is I'm going to be using right these here. two products from olive oil to do my install along with my Escher Girl 
lace glue so i basically so, always yeah. do the same thing in <laughs> every video so this is gonna be a quick install you guys i'm just using my primer from Esha girl just to clean my skin before i begin this install So today I'm gonna be taking my black opal foundation in the shade Carob. Yeah, just gonna do that, tint the inside of the wig using that. So once I finish tinting it, I'm going in with my ORS spray just to set that. So once I'm done spraying the inside of the unit with my ORS spray, I'm going in with my blow dryer just to blow dry that. So now I'm just going to position the wig where I'm going to lay it. And once I have everything lined up how I want it, I'm just going to cut off the extra lace around my air tabs area along with the front Portion. So the glue that I'm going to be using today is my Escher Girl Lace Wand Glue. So I'm just going to be applying two to three layers of this glue. And once I'm done, I'm going in with my blow dryer and I'm going to blow dry that until it's tacky. So once the glue is tacky, I'm just pulling the lace onto the glue and I'm just going to push that down with my fingers. And I'm going to further take my rat tail comb to push the lace into the glue. So once that is done, I'm going over that with my ORS olive oil lace spray and I'm just going to spray that on the lace so once that is done I'm going to further melt everything by using my blow dryer and then once I'm done blow drying everything I'm going to melt that with my elastic band a bit more so now i'm going to be taking my ors olive oil foaming mousse and this is basically all i use today to lay the top portion of my wig along with my edges so now i'm going to be taking my cuticle scissors to cut off the extra lace to the front portion of this unit so once that is done and all the lace is cut off to the front i went in to further melt the lace a little bit more so i'm going to be adding a few layers to the front of this unit so that it could frame my face a little bit more so once the lace has been melted it's time for me to finesse my baby hair so I'm going to start to work on my baby hairs. I'm going to be doing a minimalistic amount of baby hairs today. So to lay my baby hair, I'm just going to be using my ORS foaming mousse just to set my edges in place. So I'm just going to be taking the mousse and I'm just going to be swooping the hair in the direction I want them to go until I am completed working on my baby hairs. So I'm just gonna repeat the same process. So now I'm just working on my side burn. So I'm just going to continue to be using my ORS foaming mousse and so far you guys the mousse held my baby hairs perfectly like they didn't move and I definitely love this foaming mousse. For the first time using it zero complaints like with the foaming mousse and the lace spray the edges kept in place for hours so i'm just gonna continue to work on finishing up my baby hairs So once I'm completed finessing my edges, I'm just going to go back over with more of the ORS foaming mousse just to set everything all together. So I'm just applying more of the foaming mousse and you guys, the wig did not lift by me using this foaming mousse. It just held everything in place, which I loved. So now I'm going over that with my ORS setting spray just to set everything in place. And then I'm going over that with my blow dryer before I go in with my elastic band to further melt this unit. 
so i'm just gonna go ahead to further melt this lace while i work on perfecting the curls on this unit so i'm gonna be using my bc way 1.5 wide titanium flat iron just to add a bit of bump to the top portion of this unit So this video is also in collaboration with BC Way on Amazon. So if you are interested in purchasing this 1.5 wide flat iron, well, all the information will be listed in my description bar down below. So once the lace has been melted, it's time for me to perfect this unit a little bit more. And I just go in with a little bit more of the Aurora S spray so that it could hold the top portion of this wig a little bit more more so i'm just gonna continue to finesse this unit so i'm just gonna be taking my maybelline fit me powder in 365 just to perfect the parting space a little bit more to the front portion so that the parting space could look a bit more precise and i'm just adding a few more layers to the front portion so that it could frame my face a little bit more and to set the curls in place i'm going back over with my ors spray so now i'm going in with my iso plus hair sheen just to add a bit of shine and luster to this unit and i'm just going to focus that mainly on the ends and the top portion of this so this is how the unit is looking you guys and i'm definitely feeling this highlighted honey blonde unit from silhi hair company so you guys this is the end result of the installation process of this unit i'm just finessing it to my liking giving it a few final touches and yeah so far so good you guys and to complete the entire install i'm just gonna go back in with my iso plus hairspray again just to complete the look all together so thanks so much for watching you guys and i hope you guys enjoyed the installation process of this 18 inch honey blonde unit from a cd hair company so you guys this is the end result of this 18 inch honey blonde unit from a Sealy hair company so a bit about this unit this is a 180 percent density unit and the lens for this unit range from 10 inches up to 28 inches and i'm wearing their 18 inches in 180 percent density they have 5x5 five five lace closures along with 13 by 4 lace frontal wigs so this unit retails for $206.90 on their Sealy hair website so again i'll leave all the information along with the discount code for this wig in my description bar down below so this is 180 percent density you guys so it does have a bit of body to it which i love they have 150 percent density and they also have 180 percent density and this unit is a 13 by 4 parting space i did went ahead to bleach the knot on this unit before i begin the install and i also pre-plucked the hair a little bit more the wig did come pre-plucked so if you are a beginner you can install the unit straight so out i the personalized box. it to my liking you guys and to lay my baby hairs today i just used my products that i got from olive oil i used the olive oil foaming mousse and i used the fix it spray and so for you guys this hold on this spray is really good don't know if it's better than got to be blast free spray because i have not put this to the test yet but so far so good you guys normally when you put mousse on your wigs they would normally lift at the side but this wig stayed in place so so far for this spray it's definitely 10 out of 10 for me so far so i'm gonna be testing it out to see if it actually holds up when it's hot outside um, i'm definitely I'm feeling gonna... the honey blonde on this wig it's giving all the gives you guys like it's a beautiful unit and the lens is super gorgeous as well so far so good i 
experience minimal to little shredding on this unit when I washed it pre plucked it and bleached or not so again I'll leave all the information for this honey blonde 18 inch unit in my description bar down below along with their discount code which I'll put in the video right here so if you are interested in purchasing from Sealy hair company all the information will be listed down below so thank you again for watching this installation video I hope you enjoyed it and until next time always remember to put God first in everything that you do and see you in my next video God bless